This is NAB Show Live. So, in one sentence, we created a new kind of advertising ecosystem for gaming and esports. We like to call it blended in game advertising because the ads blend into the game world on game object and become a part of it. Now, we don't claim to invent in game advertising, it existed for years, but what we brought to this market, which is very new, is the ability to sell it in a programmatic manner, uh, which is uh, uh, very scalable. The ability to measure it according to the International Advertising Bureau standards. Uh, the ability to work with certain brand safety tools like Moat and others, so brands can feel safe and understand that there is no fraud, to understand that there is someone else that verify our measurements, the ability to work with data management platforms that can retarget users in and outside of the game. So essentially we took all of the tools and the, uh, uh, the processes that work very well in digital advertising and brought them to this new media, which is by the way bigger than the NFL and NBA combined and has more viewers than Netflix, Hulu, HBO combined. One of the things that, you know, is a real problem in digital advertising is, is fraud and, you know, creating a, 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 a device uh, and a bot that will go through the game world, look and find the ads and look at them enough time. This is going to be such a big channel that requires so much computing power that will cost much more than the actual payment on the ad. So. Uh, this way we believe uh, we have a unique opportunity to offer a unique value uh, uh, to the advertiser and provide something that is much more safe than other environments. Especially when we think about younger audiences, you know, Fortune 500 brands really want to reach younger audiences, but there are only three places they can actually reach them. Streaming, social, and gaming. Now. Recent scandals with streaming on what happened with teen nudity and other stuff, you know, there have been a lot of articles lately, so this is one problem. And then you have social with, uh, you know, fake news and uh, uh, privacy issues and a lot of, of scandals going on there. And gaming is another, uh, like the last place, but it's inaccessible today. And what we did is opening the access to it through the standard channels so brands and agencies don't need to change anything. They use the same tools, the same ads, the same sizes, the same stuff. They don't need to change anything. They press on a button in their data, uh, w w any standard place where they buy media today, and they buy it like any other campaign, like they buy a campaign on Google. 